uses behind the counter at Japanese local free bento shop for children. Hi, I'm Mei from Tokyo. I'm in Soshigaya Okura, Tokyo. It takes about 15 minutes by train from Shinjuku and about 20 minutes from Shibuya. In this video, I will show you children's cafeteria run by an owner, Hisako-san, and her daughter. Children's cafeteria is a place to provide a free lunch to children, mainly to single mothers, fathers, and other economically struggling households. You might think Japan is one of the most economically affluent countries in the world, but one in six Japanese families falls into relative poverty. One voluntary activity that helps them is the children's cafeteria. Let's call Kodomo Shokudo here. As we call, it's social contribution activity that has initiated in Japan. It's 2 in the afternoon. I will be closely interviewing a restaurant named Atelier Solamame. This restaurant is usually a western style serving omelette rice, hamburgers, and other dishes. The restaurant has been loved by local residents for almost 10 years because it's cozy. Apart from the regular restaurant business, Kodomo Shokudo is held at the same location every second and fourth Tuesday evening and today is the day. The Kodomo Shokudo starts at 5.30 evening, so the restaurant looks very busy right now. Let's get inside! She is the owner Hisako-san. Hisako-san was born in Setagaya herself in Tokyo and has been running this restaurant with her daughter since 2014. Hisako-san was an English teacher at high school and cram school for about 30 years in total. The reason Hisako-san started this restaurant was because her daughter Eri-san asked if she should open the restaurant in Tokyo. According to Eri-san, she loves the food her mother makes, so Hisako-san opened a cafe with Eri-san. After four years later, with the spirit of volunteerism, Hisako-san started the Kodomo Shokudo through an introduction from a local neighbors. The menu varies from day to day, and today it's chirashi zushi, a traditional Japanese dish. Chirashi zushi is similar to kaisendon, but it's a little different. Chirashi zushi is sushi made by mixing ingredients with vinegared rice. It is known as a food of good luck and is often eaten during the traditional event of Girls' Day Festival, also known as Hinamatsuri on March 3rd every year. Including chirashi zushi, a number of Japanese food have a deep connection with other annual events. How many bento boxes are you planning to make today? <laughs> How long does it usually take for preparation for bento? <laughs> Is there anything you are more concerned about in Kodomo Shokudo compared to a regular restaurant business? <laughs> Other than paying attention to nutritional balance, she cuts vegetables as small as possible so that the children who don't like them can enjoy the meal. It's very important to make bento which makes the children happy. What was your dream when you were a child? Oh, you must be humorous. Her husband lived alone in his own house in Ibaraki Prefecture. The reason they live separately is because he needs to take care of their house. In my perspective, there are unexpected a large number of households that live separately from their families for various reasons in Japan, not only Hisako-san. Hisako-san is very busy every day, but her husband is supporting her afar. How much rice are you going to cook today? That must be really hard. Do you procure all of the ingredients by yourself? Mm, that must be really helpful. Kodomo Shokudo is supported by corporate subsidies and donations from local residents. Some of the neighbors offer even fruits and vegetables. Hisako-san says there's little profit generated from Kodomo Shokudo on the other hand. Oh, the design is so cute! What's the shape? It's 
Appearance is important for Japanese cuisine, also known as washoku. It's the chance to show her skills for its color and shapes. How do you usually spend your time? Do you work only in this restaurant? Oh, you must be a really hard worker. Can you spare time for your hobby? That's so cool! Plus, she is an art college graduate and all the murals in the restaurant are her artwork. Oh, it's so beautiful! You seem to be very close with your mom. Do you argue with each other? But when Erisa is worried about something, she always asks her mom Hisako san's advice. We call it Kenka Suru Hodo Nakagai, which is Japanese famous proverb. It means the closer you are, the more you fight. I see. You also put in the leftover carrots not to waste food. これ登録して登録フォームから登録するわけよ情報。それでここに名前とか書いて、それでそれが終わったら今度は参加申し込みで。Interesting, that's the Kodomo Shokudo system. It's 5 afternoon. Children will come in a half hour. According to Hisako san, Kodomo Shokudo started out with about 20 people. There were the other members of cooking at that time. Hisako san and Eru san do all the cooking now because it's too hard to make bento for 60 children on a volunteer. Teachers specializing in psychology and university students support Kodomo Shokudo in other ways at this moment. Hisako-san's capability to get people involved is what makes it possible, but Kodomo Shokudo is supported by many different people. Now they're almost ready! That's interesting! Seems you are very busy! Are you taking enough rest? It took a few hours to make bento. How they are efficient and fast in their job. A volunteer came a little early to help out at Kodomo Shokudo. Can I have a short interview? Hi, May I ask your age? You are a student. What are you studying? Oh wow, you must be really smart. Why did you decide to volunteer at Kodomo Shokudo here? That's interesting. Thanks for your time. Now the first customer came in. Kodomo Shokudo usually starts at 5.30 almost every Tuesday. Many of those who use the service are single mothers known as minorities. In Kodomo Shokudo, they often come to pick up their bento with their children. Let's ask the users. Can I have an interview? Where did you hear about Kodomo Shokudo? 
What do you think about this system? Thanks for your time. She is currently raising a child and cannot afford to live so financially. She told me that she would like to help someone when she can afford to do in the future. She also wants her children to have the kindness to help others. Let's hear from a child who actually uses it. May I ask your age? 11. What's your hobby? That's so cool. What's your favorite menu at Kodomo Shokudo here? Oh, that's a good choice. Thanks for your time. Hisako-san runs not only Kodomo Shokudo but also another voluntary activity. That is a free class for tutoring and play, such as origami, which is a traditional Japanese play. The leader is Dr. Mayumi, the psychology specialist I mentioned a little earlier. She fills up her office and helps their children's homework with university students for free. You must be tired, but can I have a short interview? I heard you started the free tutoring program at Hisako-san's invitation, but were you willing to volunteer from the beginning or did you change your mind through the program? She says, I'm glad the moment when I'm looking at the children studying so hard. After the volunteers had left, I asked Hisako-san about her passion for the Kodomo Shokudo. I've already told you in the beginning Hisako-san started to volunteer because she was invited by the local people but there was another reason. She felt really shocked because she found there are poor children even in Japan that should be known as a developed country. Then, she started to volunteer in Ibaraki for the first time. After Hisako-san moved to Tokyo where she was born, she wanted to do something contributing to society again and started Kodomo Shokudo. Of course, there are many hardships, but she feels happy to be involved in this activity at the moment when she gets some letters from children, seeing children happy for bento or seeing their parents appreciating her. Through the interview, I felt Hisako-san's spirits that she strongly wants to be a social entrepreneur. Please let me know your idea and opinion in the comment section. If you want to watch more like this video, please subscribe to my channel and click a good button. For those who want to go to the restaurant, I will put their link so you can check it later. Thanks for watching and see you at the next video!